You also need to know about logarithms. Consider sum exponential of base to sum exponent x is equal to a. The reason why logs were invented is in order to solve for this exponent. You see, because log is the inverse of an exponential. Turns out that if you take a log base b of your answer a, you can solve for the exponent. This is the whole idea behind the logarithm. So for example, let's take log base 2 of 1 half. Well, let's say that this is equal to some number x. We can rewrite this as an exponential. Our base is 2. Our exponent is what we have solved for. 2 to the x is equal to 1 half. And therefore, we know that x has to be negative 1. Likewise, log base 5 of 125 essentially says 5 to what number is equal to 125? Well, 5 cubed is 125, and so log base 5 of 125 is 3. There is a particular log that we need to spend uh, special attention to, which is the natural log. Natural log is log base e, where e is approximately 2.71, so on and so forth, like pi, it is one of these naturally occurring irrational numbers that appears everywhere you have some sort of exponential growth or decay. E is really a fascinating number, but natural log is just log base E of x. That's all it is.